Not a zoinkling level, troll. Short 3D world and auto scroll. Where are the KCBs? Whose level is this? Version 1.12. But thank you so much for the 400 bits. I greatly appreciate you, Sega, for doing that. Wow. Aw, oh, man, that stinks. Yeah, what up, high life, low life? Thank you for shutting out high life, low life. I guess I'm supposed to probably go fast and hit that bomb before basically. I felt like I hit that really quick. I'm surprised it didn't explode it. Or was I too slow somehow? So. Or can that not be possible? That's also another possible. Okay. <laughs> 
I notice he's using a lot of you can't see those setups. Yeah, I did that at my level, and I did that in one of my levels. I said it's kind of trollish, and I swear I got hated on it. I bet you this got so much love for it, you can't see stuff. Love. You know what level I'm talking about, too, Dragon. The HP Nick one. I'm like, yeah, yeah, it was trollish. I got like so much hate for it. It's like, you mm, can't see me. It's literally the same, in a different way, same concept. Where you can't see stuff on the screen, you know? Nah, it's because the level made by me. When, pe when it's a level made by me, people are like, no. I guess I'm not just get that much. Wait, does this mode not have wall jumping? Because I swear I couldn't wall jump off that. I can't lie, I clutched on that door so, so well, but then died from the... I'm not sure if I'm going to beat this one. Uh, I'm liking this so far, but I'm like, ooh, I hope I beat this one. It says I'm going to beat this in 15 minutes. Okay, you can go too fast. Dragon, a level I've been thinking, I've been wanting to make, but I've been thinking on doing it, is one of those, like, I think they're called anti-troll levels, when they're like, 
you have, it's like clear con, this power up, and then like, you don't get the power up till like the very end or something like that. Yeah, you can't wall jump after that. The fudge. I literally was pressing as hard as I can to wall jump off. Man, I couldn't wall jump off. Yeah, I've been wanting to make the level. Uh, I've been like recently making the levels I've been wanting to really make. I'm not saying like the levels I've been making now I haven't been wanting to make. Like these are levels I've been like thinking for a while to make, but then like haven't done it. Before, like, you know what I mean? Like, for whatever reason. For whatever you, whatever reason, like example, an auto level. Like I've always wanted to make a. To me, make an auto level, but I was always too afraid to do it, and I just did it. That's another level I've been wanting to really make. This troll level is fun, but I feel like it's kind of like. Like, I feel like it's fun, but I feel like it's also unique in a sense. Oh, I needed that? Yo, what up, Koopa T? Yeah, I do it every every Wednesday that I play troll levels. I play troll levels every Wednesday. I call it, in a sense, wacky Wednesdays. I love troll levels. Not many people realize that I do love troll levels. That's why I have uh, my own troll emote. I'm like, people, I must let people know. Ah, uh, yes, yes, I am. I actually got one today from not that um discord from a viewer uh of mine uh gave me a troll of when i played it had tons of fun it was by mr J mr j it was really fun wait what Shifted over this time. But yeah, I'm getting a lot of the troll levels from the curated troll discord. That's where I got this one from. It would, but it would be Sega, but a lot of us are thinking they're not going to even release a Super Mario Maker 3 because of how the sales was. Apparently they say due to how the sales were on Super Mario Maker 2 because Super Mario Maker 1 did better in sales than Super Mario Maker 2. Even though Super Mario Maker 2 
go more than Super Mario Maker 1, but I understand the aspect because they sold more games towards like how many we use were made while this well, basically how many Mario Maker 2's were sold to how many Switches there actually are, you know? That's why I think I can understand why they're like, yeah, Super Mario Maker 1 sold more, you know what I mean? Because there was, as you know, there wasn't many Wii U's, and there was a lot of, um... A lot of um, Mario Maker 1 levels that was um, sold, you know? Wow. So, like, they're like, oh, this game sold a lot to how many consoles was there? And then basically, Mario Maker 2, there's like tons of Wii U's, but not towards how many consoles there's, you know? Another thing I think where they drop the ball too as well, uh, Dragon, which kind of pisses me off every time I make a level, is that they could have shifted one of the games to at least look more centered middle. Because, like, like, I swear I remember they're like, yeah, even a new game style. Like, remember that in the way, way beginning? And then that's why we have, like, that empty space. Because we're like, ooh, new, new game style. Because, like, they even, like, put her in our mind like that could happen we're like yeah that's cool and then it never happened and i'm like ooh, they could have just done an update to center it because i feel like it aggravates me every time i see it <laughs> i know it's aggravating i'm just like the heck Yeah, and what else weird is they still come in like ban, ban levels too, which is weird. You know what I mean? Like there'll be like glitches and stuff, and like they'll take care of that and stuff like that. But they'll like they'll take like they'll take care of like the glitches and inappropriate names and from the stuff that people report, but they won't like. Like, oh, here. And then what I think was the most funniest of it all was like. They were like, wasn't it like the one before that Link Ninji was like, oh, this is the last Ninji ever. There's not going to be any other Ninjis. And then like suddenly the Link one comes out and then we're like, what? But they did that because like they were trying to. The funny part was they did that because they were trying to celebrate. Link and then try to get more sales on the Link stuff 